My nose is itchy. Hold up, I am on my way. I'm in motion. Hey guys, it's me, Victoria, and welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel if you are new here. Today, we are going to do a vlog for you all because of Christmas. I thought we could start it off by decorating each of the pets areas for Christmas. Um, I don't have hamster Christmas cage tours this year because I just don't have enough stuff to create a full Christmas cage tour. Um, maybe next year I will, but this year I just don't. But I thought I would decorate everybody's stuff. And then after that, I thought why not give each of the pets a little Christmas treat. Um, because once in a while, you want to feel like Oprah and you just want to give everyone something. So, why not be the Oprah of pets? Santa's coming to visit No, he wouldn't miss this In Christmas times Oh, oh, oh and the sun said it is just get better On a blanket with the skyline painted in blue Ooh. So before I give all of the pets a treat I just wanted to show you guys some updates in my room Not sure if anybody cares, but I'm going to show you anyway so I put this uh, bulletin board here with a bunch of just like pictures. I have the rabbits and I have like little lights around it. It's really cute. There's Tater Tot, Honey, Bumble, um, some older pictures. So this is Isabella as a baby. And then my past rabbit bugs, um, Callie, and then my corsage. And then there are pictures of me and my boyfriend. Then we just put these shelves up. So I just have some of my favorite stuffed animals up there. They're so cute. And then I have this shelf, which is adorable as well. It just has a bunch of succulents and a cacti or cactus in that rabbit uh, planter pot. I think that's what it is, but it's just so cute. I love it. Cleo, are you taking a nap? You're so cute. I also just wanted to show you guys their like little hideout box. I got this box from like a package I ordered and it was like big. So I thought, why not cut some holes out? Give it to the rabbits. Lola's currently in it. There's some stuff on the top because they like to jump on the top too. So that's what their little area looks like right now. And then there's a teepee on the other side. And there is a door on that side too so they can run straight through. So I've just chosen these two treats. I think I got them last year. But they're supposed to be like wheat free and everything. I think they're the Rosewood brand. Hi Cleo, where's your sister? We love treats. Kate, everybody. This one is, okay, <laughs> there's too many rabbits. There you go. You get a treat, and you get a treat. <laughs> Are you licking your, she was licking it. She's just like treating it like it's her baby. Oh no, Lola, that's so mean. <gasps> you stay there. She's finishing her treat, meanie. You're so mean. No. Keep your face there. This is what it looks like behind the scenes when I'm not in front of the camera. It's just me behind it. <laughs> no! Don't steal it! Give me this treat. Where is it? This piggy just got the last crumb here. She stole it from Cleo. And Cleo's like, oh, she doesn't even notice. Cleo, why do you let her bully you like that? So rude. You also get a treat. So these are Callie's absolute favorite treats that she has. She loves them to death. Here you go. And Isabella also gets a treat too. She just gets one of these big whimsies. <laughs> Look at her, she's like, what's that? Do you want a treat? You get a treat. <gasps> Yum. <laughs> That's a little big for your mouth. Is it good? 
So Isabella actually is going to be 10 years old on the 23rd and for an English Bulldog their lifespan is actually 8 to 10 years old so Isabella is doing really really well for being 10 years old. I mean you definitely can tell she is uh, old because she does get a little grumpy sometimes more than usual and she has a little bit more health issues than she would as a puppy but she still ha is very active and loves to go for long walks and things like that ew <laughs> did we slobber all over this couch now great i see you you're gonna try and sneak some more treats i put the treats on the ledge so she's like where are they i'm gonna get more no more treats. And you, sir, do not get a treat because the last time I tried to give you a treat, you refused to eat it. And that was absolutely terrifying for me because I absolutely hate insects, but I wanted to do it for you. But I forgot that you absolutely hate everything. I dropped it. What's on? You guys see Tater Tot? Hi! What are you doing chewing on your tube? So for the hamsters, I actually also have Whimsy chews for them as well. These are dog chews, but they are safe for hamsters to chew on. So I have the alligator ones for the Syrians, and then Tater Tot gets this little tiny toothbrush. You get a treat. Are you enjoying that, Tater Tot? He's tasty. So if you guys actually haven't seen this yet, this is Tater Tot's paper mache hideout or playground, I guess. So there's a bunch of different entrances here um, and she has chewed several spots. She really enjoys chewing on this. Um, but I was thinking of doing a tutorial on this. Let me know if you want one because I'm not quite happy with how this result came out. I want a little bit more secret entrances all over the place. So if you guys want to see a tutorial, just let me know and I will do one for you guys. Hi! Are we waiting for the hamsters to wake up? And you get a treat, Bumble. Look! What like this? Do you like these? Yeah? Stretches. So Bumble's being picky and she doesn't want her whimsy right now. She wants to come out and play instead. So I'll just let her play in her playpen and I have the whimsy there as well if she wants it. Honey has just woken up as well. And you get a treat as well. Here, miss. Here you go. Where are you going to take him? Be careful. Are you going to try and take him in your house? She has a burrow right there and she's going to try and go through it. You can't fit with dad in there. I'm sorry. That's no. <laughs> Can you hear her? She's like banging it against the bars. Miss Bumble still has not taken her whimsy. Why not? It's right there. <laughs> Are you putting bedding in your house? Good job. Hi, Miss Honey. Look at her sticking her head out of her tunnel. <laughs> Did you get that whimsy in there? I hope so. So that is all for this Christmas vlog video. I hope you guys did enjoy seeing all of the animals and seeing me give them their treats and everything. So yeah guys, thank you for watching. Bye!